super excited. I can't wait for my senior year. I know it's going to be great. What have you been working on this past offseason? I would say conditioning and just working on my defense and offense. You know, we've only been a week into official practices, but what has stood out the most to you with this year's team? How much we have just grown as a team. I feel like we have all gotten so much closer over the summer, and like all of the younger classmen, I can just tell how much they have matured and they're so ready for the season. How have you tried to be a leader for this year's team, just knowing you're one of those seniors? I try my best to step up and stay on everybody, make sure they're working their hardest, but also be supportive and make sure they know that I'm always there for them. Coach mentioned getting six wins last year. What would you consider a successful year this year? I would probably say what he said. As long as we are at least one up from what we had, that would be the best. I'm super excited for this season. I think this will be um, a good season. What have you been working on this past offseason? Uh, getting stronger in the weight room and working on our defense. You know, as one of those juniors for this year's team, how have you looked up to your seniors to, you know, really set the standard? Um, our seniors are very big communicators, so they just make me want to, like, talk more on the court and, yeah. Yeah, so we're only, what, a week into official practices. What have you noticed from this year's team? Um, that we're big hustlers and we hustle down the court and everything. What do you hope to accomplish this season? To definitely, just like what Coach said, get more than six wins. I think we're very capable of that and moving forward in sectionals. How about for you individually? What do you hope to accomplish? Um, I hope just to be a better leader for the team and set examples for the underclassmen. I'm super excited because I know we have a lot of potential this year. What have you been working on this past offseason? I've been working on my conditioning and improving my game. Uh, just a little over a week into official practices, what has stood out the most about this group? Uh, we all communicate well and we have a great bond. How have you looked up to some of the upperclassmen that have been with this program a few years? Um, they can still be like a good leader, but they can still get in your butt and like push you to be harder. Yeah, so Coach mentioned you know trying to you know really find ways to be more consistent. Just what do you hope to accomplish as a team overall? I hope that we still be closer and we win more games. You know, and, and what do you hope to accomplish individually knowing this is your sophomore year? Uh, just keep improving my game. Pretty excited. I'm ready to start hustling and get back to work on the court. What have you been working on this past offseason? Um, I've been working on my mentality, getting better at actually being able to focus and get better on the court. Knowing how last season went, six seasons, how do you hope to build some momentum for this year? Um, for this year... I really want to try to encourage more people and actually motivate, become more vocal so people have the energy to actually want to get better and bring the energy on the court. What would you consider a successful season? Successful season, just whenever you get better, whenever you get progress, that's a successful season. How about for you? Do you have any milestones you want to check off? A lot of experience with this. I mean, just become a better player mentally and physically, get stronger, become a better leader. I'm super excited. I think this um, summer we've improved a lot and we're ready to be back on the court. So what have you been working on personally this past offseason? Uh, conditioning and um, being better at defense. I feel like um, I came off from an ACL tear. And so I was struggling being strong. So I was in the weight room this summer and oh, wow. so, back. So Brooklyn, as you get ready for your senior year, yeah. how do you work on being a leader for this year's team? <laughs> Crap, <laughs> Chloe! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Can you say that again? Yeah, yeah. So, what, what we said. so this is your senior season. Well, yes. How do you hope to be a leader for this year's team? Um, I just want to be vocal. I want to show um, my aggression to the other uh, players, and I hope that leads them to be more aggressive and play better defense. Uh, Coach mentioned six wins last season. Yeah. How do, you, how do you build some momentum this year and stack up some more wins? I think it's confidence. I think we need to go in and believe in ourselves, and if we do that, we can win and be better. What would you consider a successful year? Um, like Coach said, he said seven wins. That that's a better. That's an improvement. 
but um, I would lead to like winning sectionals or conference would be a good goal. Uh, super excited um, with this being my third year. Got a lot of experience coming back, um, bringing back six seniors, but also um, a nucleus of scoring coming back as well. So um, a lot of the girls are all acclimated with me and then the system that we put in. So just looking forward to the season coming up. Just knowing this is your career, for you, you know, where do you feel like the uh, do you feel like the expectations have been established in this program? Um, I definitely think they've been established, especially with this um, this last week of practice. We've been setting the standard, um, focusing a lot on defense and getting the ball out and working on our transition. So um, I think we'll surprise some people in the conference, and then when we get up, get to plan our non-conference schedule. Knowing you've got a good amount of returning bases, just. Uh, what do you remember about last year's team and you know how do you try to build on what you were able to establish last year? So we had a lot of momentum coming off of last season. Our last several games we um, won um, and were more competitive. Played a lot more kids down the stretch, but also um, we finished games. That's been our Achilles heel, not finishing games down the stretch. So, again, bringing all these girls back, knowing what the what the expectations are, and also, you know, um, just playing a little bit more harder um, in certain points of the game. So, again, I'm super excited about it, and I think, again, we'll have some fun. So. So you mentioned those aspects, finishing games, you know, keep that consistency. What do you hope to consider, or what would you consider a successful third season for you? Um, up in the uh, win total, we won six last year, so if we can win seven, I'd be happy. But also, um, at the end of the day, I'm just trying to develop these girls to be um, fine young ladies off the court. So, you know, if they can take away anything that they've learned from me these last couple of years, that's a win. For, that's a win in my book.